So what's up guys, today I'll show you how you can run Asset Across a Rally on triple screen on AMD graphics card. So for NVIDIA, you all know you can use the NVIDIA Surround, but for AMD, you can use the AMD Affinity, which is a very good tool to actually, you know, play games on triple screen. So for that, you have to get on to your display settings. For that, go to the setting icon there. After clicking on that, you have to get down here. You see, there, uh, there are a lot of options here, home gaming. In the bottom side, you see display, click on display. And here in the display section, you go down, you see, first of all, make sure all three displays are connected. And then if all three monitors are same resolution, then just click on uh, quick setup. That's all. And now if one of the monitors is a different re resolution, you have to actually select a custom resolution like this uh, for this monitor. Okay, all of our monitors are actually the same re resolution, so no need for that. But if for some reason one of the monitors is a different resolution, make sure you set the custom resolution and that will be uh, that will be easy for you. After you have spanned all these monitors uh, around triple screen, now go to display settings and make sure that the resolution is 5760 by 1080 like this. This is the dish should be the resolution. So after this, that's all. Now just run the game. Now run the, run the game from Steam or from, uh, from where you have uh, installed the game. After that, wait for some time for the game to load. So now after you have loaded the game, for the first time when you load the game, chances are that the game will automatically de de detect the resolution for the 5760 by 1080p. But if for some reason it doesn't detect RB, which button? Okay, so you cannot switch there. You can press E on your keyboard to get to settings. Now go to the display settings. You go to uh, video settings over there. On the video settings, go to screen resolution. It's like that's automatic. Now go down. Uh, no, sorry, no, not go down. In, in the automatic section, press one left and then this will be a resolution. And on there, go to full screen. Do not play this on borderless. You might uh, encounter issues. Now it's being saved. Now get back here. Now that's all. Now we can just you know, hop in a race, just like that. Actually quite simple. Sometime the whole driver might crash. Okay, I'm facing the driver crash issues. issues. Well, while loading, this part of the monitor will be black. Okay, do not get scared like, Oh, this is not working for me. I have to just buy a new PC. Okay, so this will uh, work for you. Just wait for some time. We'll see. Okay, see, there we are. See, all the monitor is being used. That was just for a loading bug. That might be a loading bug. And there we are. And the graphics card which I'm using is the RX 5750 XT. So that's actually a very powerful graphics card. But still the game, you know, the game is un unoptimized. So now I'll start the engine, just like that. First I'll change the camera. Engine start. I'll just press the button. Uh, it just feels so nice. So this is how I can drive in triple screen. Oh, I hit the, I hit the guy. No, no, no. Said, come on, come on, stop. You should stop right there. My friend, oh, hey, the Marshall. Uh, hey, Marshall. Oh, this, this guy is filming. Uh, I'll post this video on Instagram and I'll get too many views. Okay, all right then. Oh, there's a tripod. Guy with the tripod. Let's just. Five, four, three, two. Bang on. One. Uh, my gearing was manual, so I cannot downshift right now. But anyway, I hope you got the point of how this will actually whole thing will look on triple screen if we play like that. And for some reason, for AMD cards, this is a very powerful graphics card. Still, the game is running lagging horribly. You go down to video settings and you know uh, make sure to set everything to medium and. The bottom side, you'll see one thing and set the screen space reflection and uh, dynamic reflection to low or off. Dynamic reflection turn this to off. It doesn't have any purpose. And interactive elements, let's set this to low, very low and set the crowd and marshals to very low. Okay, that, that actually 
Nobody is going to see that when you are racing. Now, now it's a lot smooth. Oh, this is what I'm talking about. Oh, look at the lag. The game just lags for no reason. Now look at the smoothness. Okay, this will crash. This will crash out. I know this. And now if I, I have set all this to low. Now look at that. He's clapping. Hey, a, I'm giving a clap. You, oh, nice clap. Nice clap. Uh, you're playing well. Uh, he's gone. So this is looking actually nice actually. I'm see. And when you're racing at that speed, when you're racing at full speed, nobody's going to know, notice his face. Okay, so no point in turning that setting to ultra high the crowds and audience settings so that's all for today's video i hope you really uh, uh, understood if you're having problems and if you had any more problems then let me know here in the comment section below i'll be happy to help till then see you on my next video